here we are, Independence Hall. There it is, the Rising Sun chair. They're letting us up on the second floor of Independence Hall today. People who are going up here have no idea how rare and how privileged of an opportunity this is to go up these steps and go to the second floor of Independence Hall. They only have this open for 30 days a year. This is a, uh, a view of Philadelphia. I guess this is from the Jersey side. The state of Pennsylvania from 1790 to uh, 1800. The state capital was Independence Hall. So all the state business when the federal government was here, took place in this building, the second floor. So they have maps, pictures, a map of New Hampshire and New England. How many times? Not many times do you get to take a peek out this window. Second floor window of Independence Hall. This map here, uh, we, we had a big fight, the, the state of Pennsylvania with the uh, state of Maryland, about the uh, cutoff point, where Pennsylvania began, when Maryland began, and this is one of the maps. And this uh, tool here was used as a surveyor for the Mason-Dixon line. I think that's what the lady told me, the, the park ranger last week. This is for the Mason-Dixon line, and it was also used to figure out what part was Pennsylvania, which part was Maryland. There's a picture of William Penn wearing a suit of armor as a, like a teenager back there. The thing about Independence Hall is uh, the British occupied uh, Independence Hall in 1777, I think it was. So, a lot of the furniture isn't original. Most of the furniture was burned. And this was the uh, general council chamber. Oh, oh. George the Third of Great Britain. There he is, King George. This was like the governor's council. This is for people who, who were working with the governor would come here in this room. These are the stairs that go up to the top of the bell tower. And uh, it says that the uh, bell tower was designed by Robert Strickland. And Strickland is the guy who also did the Second Bank of the United States. Well, I think uh, National Mechanics, that bar, he did that too. The harpsichord, it's not, it looks like it, it sounds like it. Kind of like a guitar, play it. This is a modern day harpsichord. There's not many original things here. And this is where uh, militiamen kept their supplies. Guns up there, muskets. Uh, and I found out that if you want to come to the second floor of Independence Hall, you can do that in February, most likely just one weekdays. This map. This is the only place with original flooring from the original the original building and you can see that here <clears throat> this is new flooring and that is old flooring that's the original floor there is a possibility that george wash had stepped on these woods that's my trip to the second floor of independence hall all right let's take the steps down from the second level of independence hall
All right, that's it. Make sure you hit like and subscribe, and I will sail with you later. Toodles.